settings. To open the main settings panel of the Gazer Car app, tap the gear icon in the bottom right corner of the screen. In the window that opens, at the top of the screen, you will see available communication channels WhatsApp, Telegram and Facebook Messenger for contacting Gazer technical support, which operates 20 for 7 and can help resolve any issue. To send a message, simply tap the icon of the messenger you wish to use to start communication with technical support. Mode selection. This feature changes the appearance of the main menu based on the selected setting. Selecting the comfort mode means the main screen will display features for remote cooling or heating of the car. To enable this mode, simply check the box next to the comfort option. The security mode means the main screen will display information about the Gazer security system's functionality. To activate this mode, check the box next to the security option. The season selection feature adjusts the temperature settings of the car's climate system and changes the climate control scale on the Gazer car main screen. The winter mode is used during the cold season and allows you to remotely heat the car's cabin to the target temperature. The summer mode is used during hot seasons, it enables the cooling of the car's cabin to the target temperature. The target temperature can be set in advance in the climate settings. The My Cars menu is designed for selecting the primary vehicle, which will be displayed on the main screen of the Gazer Car app and to which the current settings will apply. Tapping on My Cars opens an additional menu that displays all available vehicles. To select the car you want to interact with right now, tap on the image of that car on the current screen. After that, a menu will open with the car you selected, where you can change the car's name, as well as Disable all modes and accesses, this function temporarily deactivates the system when your car is at a service centre, car wash or another similar location. Enable the car stolen mode, this function immediately locks the engine, preventing the car from moving. To activate it, you will need to enter the app's PIN code. You can learn about the security codes feature in the settings section of the Gazer Car app. These are hidden codes required to deactivate the system or access the settings of the Gazer Car Security S5. To get started, click on the Security Codes menu item. After that, two options will appear on the screen. The deactivation code is required to disable the car stolen mode. To receive this code, you need to enter the four-digit code sent to you via SMS when you tap on this menu item. The service code is required for certified Gazer specialists to access the settings of the S5 security system module via a computer, if necessary. To do this, tap on the service code menu item and enter the four-digit code sent to you via SMS. This menu contains all the settings for the car's cabin cooling and heating. The Be Ready Time settings block consists of the pre-activation time and mode duration settings. Pre-activation time is the setting that determines the time to start cooling or heating the car's cabin before the scheduled trip. Mode duration is the amount of time allocated for cooling or heating the car's cabin after the system is activated. In both settings, you can choose a time range from 5 to 30 minutes. Temperature in Be Ready mode. This block contains the settings for the comfort temperature that will be automatically set when you swipe the slider on the main screen in comfort mode. Target temperature is the function that allows you to set the temperature to which the car's cabin will be cooled or heated. Previous temperature. When this feature is enabled, the car will remember the cabin temperature from the previous trip and automatically set it as the target temperature. Max difference between inside, outside temperature. This setting allows you to choose the maximum allowable temperature difference in degrees Celsius between the outside temperature and the current cabin temperature. If the temperature difference is below the specified value, the system will cool or heat the car's cabin without exceeding the set value, ignoring the target temperature. Restart cooling mode. This feature allows the system to automatically restart the cabin cooling cycle when the set maximum temperature difference between the inside and outside temperatures is reached. You can adjust the values for automatic cooling or heating activation using the slider in degrees Celsius. Critical temperature. 
This settings block includes functions for automatically activating cooling or heating when the cabin temperature reaches a critical level. When the critical temperature slider is enabled, your car will always activate cooling when the critical temperature is reached. Set critical temperature. In this setting, you can select the critical temperature range from 35 to 80 degrees Celsius. Low on allows you to choose the temperature to which the car's cabin will be cooled when the critical temperature function is activated. In this setting, you can select a range from 30 to 75 degrees Celsius. Language allows you to choose the language for the Gazer Car App Interface.